Hello everybody, Happy New Year, it's me Spongy Knight, and welcome back to Minecraft, and today we're going to be starting Season 4 of the Mod Survival, so let's, you know, get to this, let's type in our um, season, I actually didn't show how many mods there are, hang on, let's show, where is it, okay, yeah, we've got 55 mods, last series we had 100 mods, exactly, this one I decided not to do as many mods, although I, though I still got quite a lot of mods. Also, I'm probably going to spell seasons wrong, so, you know, don't at me. So yeah, we're going to be survive mode as always. We're going to have cheats on so we can have keep inventory. Um, I think we'll leave the stuff default and we'll have the seed set to 400 because this is the fourth season. Bonus chest, um, I'll leave it off. So let's just get straight into this. So we're going to load in the world we even got a world a pro tip blocks can be mined faster if you use the if you time your clicks correctly i don't know what it means by that i'm pretty sure you just have to hold down the mine button to mine but what do i know archaeology acts as explosive resistant transparent blocks i can't read apparently okay we're in did we spawn on an island like at sea <laughs> That's pretty unlucky, honestly. Yeah, we're like in the middle of an ocean. Okay, well, whatever. Also, the first thing you may notice is the trees look a bit, you know, round. <laughs> I got a mod that basically makes the um, certain vanilla things look a little bit better. Like the trees are a lot more bushy and, the tr and they're a lot rounder. But yeah, we're on 1.12, which is cool. Oh, and I want to show, we have the animated player mod, so my character looks great. Look at me, I can punch. I even got a um, better third person, so I can like zoom around my character rather than do anything. I can even move like this. Look at me go. <laughs> uh, man, this is going to be a great series. But yeah, we're going to punch this tree. Look at me go. Look at these moves. It's like I'm dancing. <laughs> All right, we'll go to first person so I can see what I'm doing. I just want to show that off quickly. Once we get a sword, it's going to be great. It's so much fun. <laughs> I also turned off, um, there's a mod actually, eh? which disables the attack speed delays of weapons in the newer version. So I got that, which means our axes are OP because they do so much damage. <laughs> but yeah, I guess we'll plant this. And actually, I need to put in the game rule. Game rule. Um, not that one. <laughs> Keep. Inventory true. And yeah, there's a seagull here. Makes sense since we're on an island. <laughs> but yeah, I got the exotic birds on the exotic birds mod on, so we got special like more birds to look at. Like seagulls apparently. Hmm. That adds a lot more food options to the world. Okay. I'm not sure if I want to try and get a boat and set sail. I kinda like this idea of this island. I actually was, when I was testing around, I actually did find another seed that had, that was just an island in the middle of an ocean. It's pretty cool, honestly, but not very practical because we want to be able to find structures. Oh, this isn't, I guess, oh, I guess this is a good spawn for, like, stuff. Oh, we got the underground biome mod, so the <laughs> stone looks different. It's great. <laughs> I honestly think this is going to be a pretty good series. Then yeah, I say that I say that to all the series. Also, I think we have classes if I remember correctly. Let me also press O so I can see my resources. Okay, let's see what class we should be. We have so many choices. I think if we click on them, they'll give us a um, a description. Okay, more effective furnaces in Bruin lumberjack. I don't know what I want to be honestly. I wasn't sure, honestly. The, the thing about the classes is you can only pick your class once. So you kind of just have to go with that. <laughs> Self-archery, like Skyrim intended. <laughs> More effective farmer technique, fishing. I kind of want to be combat. Let's be zealot. That sounds fun. Okay, what button did I even press? I guess I, oh, I opened this. Okay, oh, it looks like you can be anything actually. Okay, so it looks like, um, I, I didn't realize you could do this. I thought you were kind of stuck with one class, but no, apparently you, you can do what, you can change if you want to. That's good to know. 
Let's make a uh, fence. We also do have um, just enough items so I can see recipes instead of craft guide. I mean, it doesn't matter. We have this, so either way, it wouldn't matter. We also do have tech guns returning. We have the Aether 2, even the original Aether. Like, we have so much. <laughs> it's just so much in this mod. <laughs> like, there's a lot of content for us to do. There's also a lot of other mods I'm not, I haven't noticed yet. You'll, you'll see in the description. I'm going to put all the mods in the description. I think there's actually a pirate ship over there. That's the wrong button. How do I get this off my screen? There's a ship over there. Oh, okay. That's weird. But yeah, there's a ship over there. I don't have um, Optifine installed. That's the only mod I couldn't get to work for some reason. I guess it just didn't want to work for whatever reason. I see some squids. They look weird in this. Like, if you look on their little picture, they actually look weird. Also, we do. Also, I notice I have two mods that do the same thing. I have the damage indicator mods to see mobs' health, but the I have another mod that shows me every block that also shows me the enemy's health if I target them. Like if I go over here, you can see my their health. Well, if I can target them correctly, you can see their health up on top of the screen as well as where damage indicator is. I had to move everything around because of the space, and so the mini map is in a weird place. <laughs> but yeah, what was I doing? I was mining a tree, wasn't I? And I got distracted by everything, <laughs> all the mods. It's alright, like. Yeah. Also, I think it's a good idea to be combat because there's going to be a lot of bosses for us to kill, so having extra damage is a welcome change. Although it might be more worthwhile to have other things. Is that a... Oh, those aren't pumpkins. Those are pumpkin spiders. <laughs> but yeah, this is actually pretty strong though because this is 7 attack damage and I can just swing it as fast as I want. <laughs> so the axe is actually really nice. Come back here, you... Seagull. <laughs> okay, what do I want to do? Well, I want to chop more trees down. Let's grab these eggs. We got a hummingbird egg. It's one chance 10%. <laughs> okay, we've got some divine leaves here. This is from Divine RPG. Yeah, we even have Divine RPG. <laughs> I really went all out with this series. <laughs> There's so many cool mods. And yeah, and we're in a fairly new version, 1.12. Well, I say new version, 1.12 has been out for, like, forever now, basically. But, you know, it's it's alright. What was that? I think I absorbed whatever that was. I absorbed the energy and I feel great. But yeah, the wall looks extra nice. I also wanted to have a texture pack, but again, um... Usually texture packs don't affect mods, so it wouldn't really matter. Besides, um, a lot of them, the mods I do have affect the environment anyway, so it works out. So what is this? Is this just divine log? What's its use? Can I make anything interesting out of it? I can make a crate. I can make chopped logs. I can make a smoker because I have the future MC mod in. I, got, I can make campfires. Actually, campfires might be the way to go. We can also make a gun stock. We can make a, an AK-47. <laughs> you know, typical Minecraft stuff, you know. <laughs> I love this. <laughs> I love this so much, man. But yeah, I think that structure over there is actually from Tech Guns. I wonder if that's a pumpkin spider. Yep. You can just tell from like a mile away. I can smell them. And yeah, we also have a uh, different health mod. So again, we'll start off with low health, but as we level up, we'll get more and more health. And I think in this series, I made it so it caps at 60 health. So we'll end up with 30 hearts. But right now we only have five. And if I press dot, you can actually see it here. <laughs> much help I have. <laughs> you can actually have it set lower funny enough. You can have it set to um, like one health if you really wanted a challenge I guess. I didn't do that because I would figure I'd die too quick. What's this? Marble gravel. That's cool. There's like special gravel. I don't think um, the previous versions had special gravel. But then again I didn't explore too much of the other biomes in last series because we kind of just settled down in one place. There was like no oceans. Now there's just ocean everywhere. 
Honestly, that's kind of a welcome change. I kind of miss the ocean. I mean, I know it has squids in it, but... Ooh, my brownies are done. <laughs> that actually wasn't um, that. I think we just leveled up in something. Or we gained experience in something. I can't tell. Whatever. Okay, well, we've got some wood. Where is the sun, anyway? Ooh, a bee. <laughs> Bees. Could we get honey? Yeah, there's bees. <laughs> Hello, bees. Ow, they bumped into me. <laughs> Actually, I think I just took four notes. Okay, so the um, bee nest is over here. I'll keep that in mind. There's some squids. But yeah, look, look, they look, they look weird because of the, um, the mod we have. Okay, we'll collect these eggs. I should probably kill these birds because I'm going to need their food. Okay. Actually, what I want to do, let's go back to where we saw, like, um, the underground. We can start mining and we can get that coal and we can make a, um, we can make, or what do I want to make? We can make a campfire and we can suppress those bees and then we can steal their honey and have some food. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I can't see my what I unlocked. We unlocked something. Okay, cool. But yeah, because we have the future MC mod low, we do have a few newer features in the game. Like we have, um, we have never right armor, for example, which wouldn't be available in this version normally. You actually don't get never right. Never right isn't um, available until like one point sixteen, I believe. So having it in this version is pretty good because we wouldn't have it otherwise. Hmm. Not that it matters. Oh, by the way, I should say I actually um, I changed up um, the Inferno mods in the previous series. They, I've had it was set normally and what was it say? Year round. Cool. Cool. I think I got the the season mod, so I guess these are dependent on season. Okay. How do I make a campfire? Camp. Here we are. So we just need, I guess, any log. And we need sticks. <laughs> I forget that. I haven't made, I actually haven't made a campfire before, before funny enough. Actually, I think I have in like, um, the, in like the SMP I play, but. <laughs> I love how I talk about the SMP, but no one, I, I don't ever show it. I've made a few friends in there, interestingly enough. But, not too many. <laughs> but yeah, we've got a campfire now. I don't know how we hold the campfire, mind you, but whatever. So let's dig around here. We shouldn't disturb it by, like, mining in underneath it. I hope, okay. I should suppress the bees. So once we get they get their honey back, we should have it. Okie dokie. Did I get any stone? No, I think I just I think I literally just collected like um, stuff. I'm trying to look at this. I'm trying to keep an eye on that. <laughs> I guess we can come back to it. I can see loads of mobs on my mini map, but I, I don't think they're above ground. <laughs> Honestly, I remember when messing around, it's very easy to die. A lot of these mobs are pretty, are pretty tough. They're no joke. This is going to be a pretty intense series. This is going to be like all spawn, but all spawn with all spawn, it's not as bad, I guess. Well, not really. Actually, all spawn is. I would say all spawn is like above this. But the good thing about all spawn is a lot of the bosses are kind of rare. Like you don't encounter mantises that often really if you think about it same with a lot of the mobs like you have to go to specific places to find them usually so a lot of times you don't really encounter them which is kind of the good part of that with this one i think a lot of the mobs actually spawn more often so it's a bit more dangerous but i think the mobs aren't as like tough <laughs> that's not to say we couldn't kill them with our current equipment it just means that we're more likely to survive if we run away from them <laughs> Okay, I guess we'll grab more stone because we're going to need a lot for our 
needs. <laughs> this will give us. We'll keep an eye on the minimap in case anything comes at us. Okay, they don't show it on this, so I just have to keep an eye on the minimap on the side of my screen. <laughs> Either way, it's going to be great. <laughs> I've got a lot to say in this episode, so I don't have to do as much cutting around. The reason I do cutting around, mind you, is um, just so it doesn't get boring with, like, you don't just listen to me, like, breathing a lot. <laughs> I mean, I cut obviously, a few things. But I try not to cut things out that are important. Ooh, we've got a zombie over here. Let's see if we can take him out. Okay, we've got two. Okay, the, uh, the the combat with the axe looks normal. Ugh. Take this. <laughs> Ugh. There's a creeper over there. Okay. I have leveled up. My life replenishes. And I got iron. Okay, there's a creeper here. Okay, look how much damage I did to him. Ow, balls, I almost died. <laughs> I don't know if I survived that. What, are we in easy mode? No, we're in normal mode. We just we just somehow survived that. <laughs> the bee just flew into the stuff. Um, what do I want to do? I want to make a furnace. I think maybe this is too close to that. Oh, no, no, they went in. They, I think they went in. What's this actually? Outpost campfire, A for two. Cool. <laughs> it's cool that it, it tells me what it's from. See an apple. Get our health regenerating. It probably isn't a good idea to use my resources this quickly, but might as well. Get an upgrade. Did we make a furnace? Yeah, we did. So we can try and make a bottle so we'll put these in there and we'll see if we can get honey that might keep us alive a little bit longer okay i see some seagulls over there <laughs> hmm. it's kind of odd not being able to like zoom in i kind of like doing it because it's fun i mean i guess i can zoom in with like editing like you could like right now for example but that's not the same as like zooming in with like optifine this is right if i get optifine working i will add it in but for now, I'm gonna we'll see how everything is about it. Honestly, so far it seems like it's pretty good. Okay, let's make a bottle. Oh, creeper! I don't know why I'm like waiting. I could just pound you to death. <laughs> oh yeah, and they, um, I got the explosive like mobs. So when the mobs die, they just like explode everywhere. Okay, let's see. Can we get honey? No, we cannot. Okay, let's break this. Okay. So, what do I want to do? I guess we'll make another campfire and sing our campfire song. It like lag there. Okie dokie. Do this again. We'll grab another campfire. This is the only way to get light right now, actually. Well, actually, I mean, we can make torches, I guess. But... So yeah, um, I guess we'll put this here, there you go, that should work. I shouldn't start off any fires, it's just like the regular campfire in Minecraft, it shouldn't do anything weird. Okie dokie, honestly I'm kind of surprised that we got iron, that actually might help us. I'm kind of want to look around actually and see if I can make out more enemies to give me stuff like that. We might want to make a better weapon, though. let's make a stone sword, that should keep us alive for now. And I guess we can make a shield, because we have all the stuff. Let's make some more wood. I think we can make a shield like um, this, right? Yeah, I can make a tower shield. It, will, it won't protect us completely, but it will keep us alive a little bit longer. Ooh, a, a bird. Anyway, I want to show you guys. When you attack with a sword, you look amazing. Like, look at this. And when you run, you can, like, Naruto run. Woo! Look at me go! <laughs> yeah, that's great. Anyway, let's see if we can kill this bird. Come here. Look at me go. 
Yeah, it's also cool that I have like the shield mod, so we can actually like block early on. I can't hit this damn bird. Let's go to first person, see if we can get a better accuracy. Okay, I killed them. We'll use our axe for this. Ooh, we can see the progression in like the top of the screen. Too bad I can't see this progression. Give me my meat. Okay. So this won't fully restore our hunger, but it will give us a little bit of hunger. It's apparently very bad. I mean, I guess it was a small bird, so what do I expect? Let's go look around, see if there's any enemies about that we can encounter. Okay, here's one. If we level up enough, we should be able to get, be good. Okay, okay. We managed to kill them. What the hell is that? Hello? Okay, you're a reaper of some kind. Oh, you attacked me! Okay, I managed to kill him. You didn't really... Oh, he dropped... He dropped something. Okay. If we kill this dude, we should be... We should level up. Level up! And we've been fully healed. Do you drop any iron? Sometimes they drop iron, which is pretty nice. Because we don't have any easy way of getting iron right now. We just kind of have to hope that we get iron. What's over there? There's some... Oh my god, it's coming this way. Okay, let's go over here and see if that dude is around. Ah! Hello. Look how cool the scent is. Look. Okay. Take this! <laughs> I love the combat for it. It's great. Okay, let's kill this bird. And yeah, just like in other versions, we can, like, our swing does matter. So yeah, it isn't just an effect, we actually can hit multiple things if they're close enough. Okay, let's see. This guy has 40 health. I think I'm gonna run. <laughs> flee! We'll flee the scene. I mean, we do have a shield, which does help, but not it won't help if we get, like, killed, of course. What's over there? Oh, that's a fish. Okay. <laughs> oh, we can kill them! <laughs> we can kill them for food. Come here. Come back. Yeah. Oh, they only drop clownfish. Those damn clownfish, or tropical fish, I guess you should say, but it's basically clownfish. I mean, in this version, it's called that, so yeah. Wait, where do the fish go? Whatever. I was just saying, the spawn, while it is not the best spawn, I feel like, you know what, I'm up for a challenge. We can survive here for a bit. We can always make a boat anyway and look for like better lands if we need to. So, this isn't the worst spawn. I've had worse as spawns anyway. <laughs> I see if there's any honey here. I didn't see anything changed about it. Hmm. Okay, so go. We got some bird meat now. I guess we can use. Ah, we're getting attacked. Ah, I died. I was burnt to a crisp. I was fighting laser creeper. <laughs> Our first death. No, it's alright though, we don't, nothing bad happens if we die. I kind of expect this stuff to happen, this is what I mean though, like, it's, it's pretty dangerous. This place is no joke, we get like, laser creepers coming after us. Is he still there? Okay, oh my god, he just instantly set me on fire. Okay, get in, get behind the tree. Oh, for god's sake, you burnt me. Okay, get to safety. <laughs> I don't know how we didn't die to that explosion, maybe we blocked it out of the... Right time. <laughs> okay, let's put this in there. We'll put these in there. And I guess we'll eat. Because this restores the perfect amount for us to be fully healed. <laughs> so we can actually regenerate health. Okay. Did we get anything good from that creeper? I don't think we did. I think he just kind of exploded. made a right old mess over here <laughs> but yeah I guess uh, what we're gonna have to do 
is we're gonna have to set up base. How long are we have? We're only 21 minutes in. That's. Um, I guess we can. Let's let's go to the other side of the island. We'll make our base over there. We'll leave this here for now in case this changes. But we'll make a little hut for us to live in. Let's see here. Before we move, actually, I want to let's make an axe so I can chop down trees. Moving on up in the world, so we can actually do stuff now. Well, not really, but yeah. And actually, can we level up now that we have levels? Okay. Random crits. Let's add some levels. Let's add another level. Um, do I have this? I don't know, it's hard to say. I definitely added levels to it. I guess we didn't add enough. Oh, well, whatever. If we get more levels, we should be able to be good. Honestly, it might be worthwhile not to, to spend too many of our levels. So we can keep getting hearts, so we can level up our health more quicker. This is like a true RPG. <laughs> well, I mean, we've kind of always had the RPG, like, theme going on, but this is more so because we actually have, like, things we can do now. In the previous series, it was just our health that we could get up. Now we can, like, level up everything, apparently. <laughs> Which is always cool. Okay, okay. Oops. I think what I'm gonna do actually, since we're pretty deep in, we're, we're gonna I'm gonna call the episode, but um, and off camera I'm gonna build a little shelter or something like over here where we spawned, so we should be okay. And I can like start mining, cause it's, we're gonna it's gonna take a while to get things done. <laughs> but yeah, and again, let a level. <laughs> If I remember correctly, actually, if you mine leaves, you get lo you can get loads of um, of the levels with the advent mod. Okay, we got like a strange egg here. I think this is from like nests from birds. We got our inventory. <laughs> it's already a mess. That's for usual. Okay, we do have the backpacks mods. Actually, it's a different backpacks mod this series, but... Right now, we can't actually make any bags even if we wanted to. We need to get gold, which is funny. <laughs> I mean, yeah, it gives a use for gold, so I'm not complaining. Okay. I think I'm going to flatten out the land, and I'll make a little small house here for now. I think in previous series, I've just made, like... What, what can I remember? Actually, I think in the first series we we just lived in a pirate one of the like the pirate ships from the Better Dungeons mods, and then in series two we tried to live underground, but that didn't work out because there was lava everywhere. So I moved it on top of a mountain and built an actual house. And in season three we built we had a we we built into a mountain because I wanted to do that in season two. So I guess this season, we're going to just, I don't know, make a never home. <laughs> I don't know. Um, I guess we're just going to build a small house for now. We can always change our locale later. For now, we've, we'll just stick around there. Although we are going to have to go exploring, so we can't just settle down in one place. But for now, we I guess it's not the worst idea. Oops, let me do that. Wait, where'd that go? Oh, that went in, that, that went somewhere, but I don't know where it went. Let's grab all this. The good thing about having not enough items as well is we can, like, survive a, well, we can, like, cheat things in if we need to. Not that I would cheat too many things in, I just, I'm just saying that if we get screwed over by a glitch or something, I can, it's not going to be the end of the world, I can just fix it with great to bees. Not that it matters, since that usually doesn't happen too much, but you never know, glitches are glitches. <laughs> Okay, we have made a box, kind of. Let's get more words quickly. We'll make a house frame. This is my house, there are many like it. But this is my house. Okie dokie. That's all we have. So, yeah, this is the house for now. It's very bad, it doesn't even have a roof, but it's alright. 
God begins somewhere, right? But yeah, thank you so much for watching, everybody. I hope you guys enjoyed. I mean, we have we have some good stuff already. We got stone weapons. We got a wooden shield. We have food, kind of. I have everything I always wanted. Let's see an apple. <laughs> oh yeah, it's eating animation. I forgot to show that. I guess you guys get to get a look at that. But yeah, thanks so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. Remember to leave a like and subscribe for more season four of the modded series. And I'll see you guys next time. Boop.